Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sam. So, today we'll be talking about a very, very important and serious matter. Right, it's about Ethereum, Ethereum Reorg. So, first, I'm going to assume everyone watching this video doesn't know what Reorg is. So, I'm going to start by explaining what a Reorg is. Um, and then we'll come back to the story. But first, let's look at the market, right? So, Bitcoin is still well below that is still way below $31,000, right? Uh, we're just expecting Bitcoin to break $31,000 and get to $32,000. Let's break <laughs> Right, so Binance, Binance, uh, uh, um, BNB is, is at fifth position. Cardano is at number eight, $0.5, $0.49, approximately $0.5. Solana is at uh, $44 and is down 8%. Amazingly, Dodge is still doing well. Right, so uh, just 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 to say this, right? Um, in as much as um, Luna had its issues, Luna still has a way better technology than Dodge. Dodge was just a meme coin with no use case. At least Luna had a use case. But issue Luna had was uh, they didn't do all proper checks to make sure that there was no loophole in their design. Anyways, moving on. See, this market is so. Should I say irrational? Anyways, I'm sure you guys know what I'm trying to say. And Litecoin had a, a recent upgrade called Nimble Wimble, right? We had, we did a video about this. I was it two days ago, right? Please make sure you check it out. I have a, a, a video on protocol that is coming up, and also Monero has an update that is coming up. Uh, May, June, June, July, June, July, yeah, uh, an update is coming to Monero um, in June, July, I expect that to make the price pump, but I don't think that's going to happen because Litecoin just had its upgrade and the price did not move at all, rather, the, right, rather Litecoin is down 65%, <clears throat> right, so what I usually tell people is um, when there is storm like this, that is when you will get to know the, the the coins with the with the best use case, right? Um, right, coins with with good fundamentals and good technology will always stand, will always last long in the market, right? So, uh, looking at the looking at the chart, uh, Bitcoin is still around. Let it load, okay? Bitcoin is still around this region. Let's draw a line. You see, it's it's just forming a support around here. Uh, let me see if I can zoom in a little bit. Yep. So you see what Bitcoin is doing around here is the same thing it's doing here and here um, and here. So this this was the parts we uh, the points we predicted um, last year. If you're watching our video, um, since I didn't I didn't clean the line just in case we retest it and I didn't know we're going to retest it this period. To be honest with you. All right, let's go back to our news. So Ethereum had a reorg yesterday, and of course I, I will explain um, what part of Ethereum had a reorg. But first, let's let's find out what a reorg is. So for that, we're going to look for a definition. I know the definition, but let me just read it out from the website. So uh, put very simply, reorg attack is a deliberate attempt to rewrite history by creating an alternate legitimate chain of transaction right that is the chain with the most proof of work it's usually now in this case it's proof of sake right it's usually done by mining and anyways just know reorg the, the whole story is getting too long right just know reorg is an attack to to change to to make blockchains mutable so uh, there's 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 a transaction on, on a blockchain you want to alter that transaction what you do is you reorganize right that that uh transaction or that blockchain so that's putting it on a, on um in google search right so a real of course went to different okay i don't like that explanation because it doesn't hit it well put very simply a real is a deliberate attempt to rewrite the history that's just the best explanation a real often okay when a block is removed from the blockchain okay just know in summary real is when you alter the data in the blockchain or the block in the blockchain i know many of you were taught to believe it's impossible for that to happen in the blockchain right so that is the difference between when 
all you know about blockchain is from social media <laughs> when you actually be doing your own research so a reorg is actually possible in every blockchain including bitcoin yes you heard me right including bitcoin now there's a difference between a reorg cannot happen in bitcoin or in blockchain and a reorg has not happened in a blockchain or in bitcoin those are two different things right so uh the fact that it does not happen doesn't mean it cannot so it's like it's like saying um i want to go to the moon you don't say you can you want to go to the moon like, you, sorry it's like saying you want to use your own wings your own uh, what's the best example good it's like saying you want to teleport to uh from country from united states to canada you cannot because it's impossible right so you cannot because it's, it's impossible so if if you cannot teleport human beings cannot teleport so you can rightly say it cannot happen right but if human beings can teleport right so you saying it can happen makes your statement wrong so can bitcoin blockchain be real the answer is yes but it hasn't happened or should i say it's difficult for it to happen so those are two different things i just hope the explanation was very easy because oh my let's move on so there, there was um there was an incident that happened years back i can't remember how many years but let me see this article okay in 2019 yeah it was in 2019 where binance was was hacked and i think about four thousand four thousand bitcoin was i can't remember the amount of bitcoin but i think it was a lot four thousand bitcoin was stolen from binance and binance ceo came up with an idea i said hey let's rehog bitcoin network now remember what I, what I said about teleporting if it's impossible to reorg the bitcoin network the thought wouldn't have been there the same way you don't think about oh i want to go to uk and right now i'm in canada let me just teleport you don't think about it because it's not possible right now hope that was easy to understand so any blockchain can be reorged right but um yeah, this is the tweet. Okay, let's let's just let's just see if we can check the tweet out, right? So, um, blah 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 blah. Okay, to put this to bed, it's not possible. Bitcoin ledger is the most immutable ledger on the planet. Done. But let's let's come back to 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 where it all started from. He said after speaking with various parties, including this guy, this guy, and this guy, this guy, and others, we decided not to pursue the reorg approach. Remember, you don't try to do what is impossible, right? So it's actually possible to reorg a blockchain, right? But it's harder in some blockchains, such as Bitcoin. And, and, and of course, you will spend a whole lot of money, a whole lot of time, and, and whatever. So cons. Uh, one, one we may, we may damage credibility of BTC. You see? Two, we may cause a split in both the Bitcoin network and community. So, so guys, it's possible. Now, now the same thing happened to Ethereum just recently. Why they are trying to move to a proof of stake, right? So, while well, I, I, I don't want to read through the whole article, so so you don't get um, it's all it's all technical stuff, right? But this screenshot we we actually explain the whole thing. So, uh, why they were trying to um do the one of the upgrades in the, in the ethereum network to move from proof of work to proof of, proof of stake some blocks were omitted one two three four five six seven blocks were, were omitted so that is what you called a uh, reorg so uh there's a tweet that follows where this guy uh is actually one of the guys working on it and he actually made a statement here that really touched me so he said uh the amount of attention this tweet got um Specifically from people not interested in, in Ethereum success makes me almost regret doing this. And Vitalis, Vitalik, who is the guy behind Ethereum, uh, that started the, the whole thing, said, "Please don't regret. Do, do regret it. Truth seeking is more important than not giving the wrong people uh, rhetorical ammunition or whatever." Right, so um, the summary of the whole thing is um, a reorg happened on the Ethereum uh, um, beacon. Beacon chain. So the Ethereum Beacon chain experienced a seven block deep rehog. That's that's pretty bad. Just in case you don't know, that's that's really really bad. Um, which is about 2.5 hours ago. 
right? So that's that's really bad. But um, this just goes to prove that hey, you, you, you remember, you remember when stuff like this happened in other blockchains, how the entire crypto space you know, we're pounding on that blockchain. And I remember making some tweet. I said, hey, this stuff that happened on this blockchain did not happen because the blockchain was designed for it to happen. That any blockchain can have that same issue. So the fact that it doesn't happen in blockchain A or blockchain B doesn't mean it's impossible. But I, and, and just for the record, this is the first time Ethereum is, is having a reorg, as far as, far as I know, right? Uh, just in case you know, uh, you are aware of any reorg, in the past in ethereum network please let me know so this is a tweet from 2021 and it says let's do a little thread about uh, a little thread on how reorgs work on pos right so the guy that wrote this this tweet was actually very optimistic right uh, just as we are optimistic about bitcoin just as we're optimistic about ethereum about polka dot about even about luna I remember these things are built by human beings so they have the capacity and the ability to fail let's not forget that all right so he was very optimistic i don't want to i don't want to read through the whole thing but this part here so it's eight says or track it says i said i'm reading by in pos ethereum right now remember this was written in october 30th 2021 in pos ethereum x post you don't, don't even bother to try to know what x post is just know uh, expose reorgs right become practically impossible why power of parallel attestation just forget about all this all this nonsense here just know he said it's actually it's almost impossible for a reorg to happen but ladies and gentlemen a reorg happened on the ethereum blockchain the only blockchain so far that has not experienced or had no record of reorg is bitcoin now that leads me to what I've been saying for several years. There is no perfectly decentralized blockchain out there. Not even Bitcoin. I know people are going to hate me for saying this, but I've been saying the same thing over the years. And of course, one of the reasons why uh, you know people don't, don't listen is because they don't see me, you know, driving the big cars and you know, chilling with the big boys, the crypto big boys, but. You know, it's the truth, right? And Ethereum just proved that hey, we've not had real for years, but it just happened. And why have I been saying this thing over the years? Because any blockchain that is built by human being, not God this time, has one or two levels of centralization. Some some centralizations are very obvious for some people to see. Right, some centralizations are not so obvious for people to see, but they are there. Every blockchain in the world, including Bitcoin, has some level of centralization. Right, and one of the reasons why you know we keep telling people to to run their own node, you know, to get interested in blockchain. Right, so the people, the more people run their nodes, full nodes and whatever nodes, right, so the more people get to know about Bitcoin and you know support the development, the more decentralized it becomes so this different technology will only get their level of centralization uh, de decentralization will only get better as as time goes on well <laughs> i hope i've been able to explain to you what a blockchain reorg is uh, okay let's see let's see uh, let's let's see if we can do a small research because this video is supposed not supposed to exit 15 minutes let's see if we can find um different blockchains that have had reorg so uh, okay, Ethereum did not have a real Ethereum. Ha Ethereum Classic actually had a 51% attack, which some people actually called call the real. But um, anyways, we're not talking about this in this video. We'll talk about this in another video. Uh, please, if you if you learned something, make sure you hit the subscribe button and uh, and and of course the bell button. And I'm gonna do another video letting us know what's next for Ethereum. What's next for for Ethereum Classic? What's next for Bitcoin? Right, where we're going to from here all right make sure you check the, the, the description you're going to see my whatsapp number you can add me up on whatsapp and our telegram link is also in the description see ya